new partner to MAP EDU. What does MAP EDU mean to me, that partnership mean to me? Um, I, I really think it's the, the opportunity to be part of a network of networks, if you will. They connect a lot of dots very well and they, their network is very broad. So the opportunity to come into that network system, whether it's, it's regional, statewide, national, or even in some cases international, the, the opportunity is just tremendous. And to be a partner uh, with Matt EDU uh, means a great deal to me in terms of professional development, camaraderie, but also the ability to work with some absolutely phenomenal people in their fields. So it's actually somewhat humbling to be part of this group. I'm not quite used to it yet, but I'm very excited about it. So let's talk a little bit about training. So have you all been having fun with your workshops today? Yeah. yeah. It's fun to make stuff, isn't it? Yeah. And design it and make it? So how many of you plan to go get training beyond high school? Okay. Do you know what you want to do? I mean, do you want to go to a four-year college? Do you want to go to a two-year college? Or maybe you don't know yet. Still making up your minds? So let's go through this. Everybody get one of these? And I'm not going to read it. Don't worry. I'm just going to highlight a few things. But first, let me start off by saying that in Washington State, as Robin said, we have a multitude of colleges that teach composite technology. And we're very, very lucky to have such good programming in this state. And we're very lucky to have organizations like Matt EDU, where we are today, supporting material science. So um, tell us a little bit about your background, mm -hmm. how you evolved in this role that you have. Sure. Yeah. So my role is, uh, it's kind of a mouthful. I'm director for the Center of Excellence for marine manufacturing and technology for the state of Washington. And essentially that means I work with industry and education throughout the state to support workforce development in the maritime industries. And um, I think like many people in my position, it was a, a rather circuitous, circuitous uh, road to, to where I am now. At the beginning of my career, I started out as an economist with the US Department of Labor and that was very interesting, I learned a lot. And then I segued into banking. And I worked in the commercial banking world for a number of years. And that took me into economic development, which exposed me to the marine world at a different level. I've been a lifelong boater. I grew up by the water, so I love, I love the sea and I love boats. 